Hey everyone, it's Moss Distribution. As you know, we're the very proud owners of the Snow Wolf line. To make things a little more interesting, we have brought a new cub to the Wolf Pack. Snow Wolf 200 Watt Temperature Control Box Mod. Let's get started. As you can see here, it is at a magnetic back door, holding two 18650 batteries. 30 amps are recommended, such as VTC4s or VTC5s. Great batteries. Uh, so let's turn it on. I was already on, so I'll turn it off for you guys. It's five clicks. One, two, three, four, five. Let's modus. And then one, two, three, four, five. Snow Wolf. And as you can see here, it is auto locked. Auto locked. It's five clicks, just for safety precautions. We five clicks. So one, two, three, four, five. It's back on. Uh, some specs about this mod is that it's variable wattage from 500 watts to 200 watts. Temperature ranges from 100 degrees Celsius to 350 degrees Celsius and 212 degrees Fahrenheit to 662 Fahrenheit. It is the only device to show all variables in real time. As you can see here, all numbers are there. Everything changes. A little too hot. <laughs> Right now I'm currently running canthal wire and as you can tell the temperature goes away indicating the canthal is not nickel. Watch there, temperature goes away. So again, a little too hot, 150 watts. <laughs> but as you can see, if I juice it up at 150 watts, it is continuous vape. Juice that up real fast for you guys. Continuous vape. Now say I bump it up to 200 watts. I actually change to a pulse mode. So I bump it up to 200 watts. And on top of the watts, on the water side, you'll see a P indicating that it is in pulse mode. And just it up again for you just to make sure. hot. See how it is pulsing? Indicating that it is pulse mode. Now let me show you guys what it is in temperature con temperature control mode mod. Let's see. Get my cap for this real fast. This is nickel wire build. This is going to be a 28 gauge, 15 wrap nickel build. And every time you put a new atomizer on, it will ask you if it's a new atomizer for safety precautions. Just press yes. And there you go. So the maximum output wattage in temperature mode is 70 watts. Even though you're at 200 watts, it only hits 70 watts max. And by holding the plus and minus, you'll be able to change the temperature. As you can see right there, it is blinking, indicating you can change temperature, just like that. Let's put it back at 533 or some shit. All right, so also, press it again, it would change your wattage. So let's go down to something I actually vape. 70 watts is kind of too much, so I'll put it at like 40. There you go. So, to explain temperature a little bit, uh, when the cotton starts to get dry, the wattage will start to drop uh, to protect the cotton, therefore, no more dry hits. You can see the wadding, wattage going down. If I blow on it, it'll be a little faster. And it's less of a burn now. I'm not getting any hot pots or anything, even if I'm holding it for so long. That's the Snow Wolf 200 Watt Box Mod. For wholesale inquiries in USA, please contact us at smodus1 at gmail.com or our contact in, for international distributor, ISK. Thank you.